Let me get a crash in the chat. What is going on, YouTube? Fox here. Welcome to you guys here with a brand new video. And in today's video, we're gonna be re re <laughs> we're gonna be revisiting one of my favorite games on the new gen consoles for Call of Duty. We're gonna be playing Call of Duty: Modern Warfare Remastered. If you guys want me to play another old school Call of Duty or another Call of Duty or just like another game in general, like I can play Doom 2016, I can play Rainbow Six Siege, I can play Halo possibly. If you guys want me to do something like that in 2020 and see what games are like, you know, from back in the day, let me know down in the comments. Comments, comment something, please. I, I like it when you guys comment. So whenever you guys comment anything, it's, it's awesome. So if you guys do enjoy this video, make sure you guys leave a like down below, subscribe, turn on notifications, and without further ado, let's go, bros. Alrighty, so we got some Modern Warfare Remastered here. There we go. There's one guy that's dead. Now, Modern Warfare Remastered is a little controversial in the aspect of DLC weapons and supply drops and things like that because a lot of people feel like that was a panic knife. Uh, a lot of people feel like the game should not have had DLC weapons or supply drops or anything like that. And I kind of agree. But at the same time, this weapon only has about like 20 base weapons. Oh, I just killed that guy who was on the street. This game only has about like 20 base weapons in the game. Or not 20, it's like 25 or so. Honestly, that's not a lot. So, I'm gonna be real. I don't really mind the DLC weapons. Truly, I truly don't. I truly don't mind them. And I think the biggest reason why I don't mind the DLC weapons is because they're not available in the supply drops. The DLC weapons in this game are only available um, when you complete, I guess, collections, if you want to call them collections. They're collections in World War II, but in this game, I'm pretty sure they're called something else. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh my god. And we're using the Mac 11 or the Mac 10 or whatever this weapon's called. I can't remember, honestly. Like, I'll get turned on. What are you doing? Because this weapon is a DLC weapon. I just can't remember what it was. Oh man, just get destroyed. No, dude. Fuck. Oh, wow, that dude's like crawling on the ground. Did you see him? <laughs> now, the Mac 10 or the Mac 11. I can't. Oh, yeah, Mac 10. It says in the bottom right hand corner. The Mac 10 in this game is freaking insane. It's nuts. It's awesome. It's really, really good. It's an SMG, very similar to the Mac 10 or the Mac 11 that we saw in Black Ops 1. I feel like if you played Modern Warfare Remastered, you definitely played some old school Call of Booties. Wow, he held it. Oh my god, dude. He. Oh. Come on! Use code FOXY for 30% off all G Fuel products and the brand new G Fuel content shaker. It's fabulous. And, and it helps me out as a content creator. Okay, bye. Alrighty. And speaking of DLC weapons, we have the XMLR. This is like the SC2010. I'd say like it's like a mix of the SC2010 from Ghost and the ACR from MW3. It's like a it's like a hybrid of both of those. And this is probably like one of the best weapons in the game, in my opinion. Oh, I have a silencer on this. I didn't know that. Okay, yeah, nice name. I know I say this for almost any time I play Modern Warfare Remastered. This game ha holds a special place to me. It was the game that I started streaming Call of Duty on, and it was the game where I gained a thousand subscribers on and things like that. And I love this game. I had so much fun on this game, honestly. And I haven't had as much fun on any other games except this one. And I just, I love this game. I love the maps on this game. And I guess it's because, you know, Call of Duty 4 is such a good Call of Duty game. At least for, at its time, it was a really good Call of Duty game. Like, it's pretty bare bones now. So, fun fact, Wet Work was the first ever Call of Duty map that I ever played on back in the day. Me and a good friend of mine, Eric. Big shout out to Eric. We were taking a break from Halo, I'm pretty sure. And so we played Call of Duty 4. It was my first time ever playing Call of Duty. And we won't be one on this map. I'm not even gonna lie. I got freaking smashed. But I couldn't see. I'm gonna be real. I couldn't really see. And, you know, the map was like super just dark. And I couldn't just couldn't see anything. Alright, so I'm gonna be real with you guys. One of the best things about this game is Exclusion Zone. Exclusion Zone in Modern Warfare Remastered is the best thing ever. It's the best camo, and you can't tell me otherwise. This camo is probably one of the best Double final kill. camos we've ever had in a Call of Duty game, and it's not even close, in my opinion. You know, everyone's got their own opinion, I guess. Hi, how are it's a guy. You? Why are you sitting there? It's another guy. No, 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 no. There's no extra safe spaces for these little, little noobs to hide. Oh my god. There's one. Come on. I need more. I need more. I need more. No, dude, I- Oh, dude, he fucking flanked me on the radar, man. Choke the hella chopper there, bros. Did I really just throw that? I definitely just killed myself. I'm so dumb. Why did I just do that? You suck! Dude, you've gotta be fucking kidding me, bro. I'm getting the worst fucking timing! Yeah. 
Yep, he knew it. Yep, he knew it too. I'm just gonna throw that down there just in case. Hopefully I don't die and hopefully I don't respawn over there. Like, oh, we got a helicopter. Let's go. Up. Oh, well, the game's probably gonna be over soon, but it's all good. We got a helicopter. Double kill. Killing frenzy. We go. We're on a merciless. The final camo in this game is Exclusion Zone, and I love it so much. It reminds me of the Paranormal Film Posits. I said that in my final camo in every Call of Duty video, and this guy's just sitting there. Wow, you're shooting my body when you're sitting in a corner? That's awesome. Here's my helicopter. Eat that, buddy! Also, let me get a crash in the jet. I thought about it mid-game and I forgot to say it. I'm, I'm so sorry. I feel like I let everybody down. You had it all and you blew it! Okay, so I'm not gonna lie. I'm just gonna use the M16 for this for this, uh, for this this match. Just because, uh, yeah. Yep, one burst. One burst king. Double kill. Okay, never mind. Triple kill. Never mind. Okay, here we go. Wow! Okay, that's cool. So this is vacant, and vacant is obviously a Modern Warfare for this year's game. I keep calling it Modern Warfare 2019 because there's just so many Modern Warfares, and people keep saying, Oh, you know the game's not called Modern Warfare 2019, right, stupid? It's like, yes, I know, I know, I understand, but there's so many fucking Modern Warfare games that people don't know. And I'm trying to make sure people know the difference between Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare, Modern Warfare Remastered, and Call of Duty Modern Warfare. You understand why I say Modern Warfare 2019? People get so triggered and annoyed by it. It's super funny, actually. I, I truly laugh at it, and I think it's hysterical. This gun is such a cheat gun, dude. Like, it's such a cheater. Like, literally, like, let me camp up with this, bro. Give me a hell of a chop, dude. Let's go, baby. Tubes. I mean, I am using an M16 with stopping power and a red dot, so. Oh, I'm garbage. So, guys, let me know down in the comments, what do you guys think of the remastered game? Do you guys like it? Do you guys dislike it? We're actually gonna pick this up. Do you guys think that this remastered game is garbage? Do you guys wish they, like, I don't know. Like, I don't know what this game could have done better, in my opinion. Yeah, another airstrike? Holy crap, I'm just, like, picking up weapons now. I'm playing this game like it's Modern Warfare. Oh no. Fuck, man. I didn't do that. I, I deserve that. That's what I get for playing the game like it's Modern Warfare. That's what I get. Just laying down in the back of the map, dude. That's so fucking gross. There we go. Come on. Oh god, don't run that way. Man, we're just we're just destroying these kids. See, like, this is what I'm saying, man. I played this game non-stop. Guys, let me know what your favorite map is in Modern Warfare Remastered. And let me know if you guys played Modern Warfare Remastered instead of Infinite Warfare back in 2016. Because everyone knows how the game was released with Infinite Warfare, and they said it would never be sold separately, and then it ended up being sold separately. <laughs> so, just let me know what you guys think down in the comments. We got Winter Crash. Let me get some Winter Crash in the comments. We also have this awesome Prism camo, and this is one thing that I really love about Modern Warfare Remastered. Modern Warfare Remastered went ahead and started doing events. This is pretty much the Call of Duty that the events started on, actually. Modern Warfare Remastered started doing events for certain times of the year. They did one for St. Patrick's Day. They did one for Christmas or the holidays or whatever, obviously with Winter Crash and things like that. They did one for 4th of July and, you know, the summer. It was just an awesome time. And it was the first time they had ever been done, really, for Call of Duty. I know that Black Ops 3 had done events, but it wasn't like this. I know that Black Ops 3 did DLC events where they would bring out new weapons and things of that sort, but they never had themes until Modern Warfare Remastered started doing themes, and I think that's really freaking sweet and awesome. That guy's running around with a beer bottle, I'm pretty sure. And yeah, in Black Ops 3, they had certain costumes and things like that for, like, the specialists and things like that. They would have, like, Halloween ones and stuff of that sort. But, like I said before, it wasn't, like, this in my opinion I think that raven software did this much better than triarch in my opinion yeah dude these guys are bots holy shit why are you sitting up here what are you doing did you with a slow bag i am pretty pretty much like sucks balls i wonder if that guy has claymores up there Cause like I wanna go, I wanna go get him, but like I feel like he's just in there and he just has claymore set up all over the place. Wow, I'm literally just like spawn trapping these kids. Oh no! 
No, dude, the guy in the fucking building killed me. What a bastard, dude. Well, guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys did, make sure you leave a like down below, subscribe, turn on notifications. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Come on.